Hi, I'm Matt Tevis. My name is Carrie Postma. Uh, Hello, me. Most of my friends call me Sam. My name is Skyla. Hi, my name is Krista Newtor. My name is Jay Jin. I'm Dave Winstone. I'm a writer and communicator. I just joined a youth group. As a teacher, you have so much going on every day. I wrestled with how does how does creating logos or websites impact God's kingdom? I was thinking, how do how can we get students to encounter the beauty of the gospel. I needed something that was inspiring, but I also knew I needed the Lord. I kind of fell into just this groove of helping with creative openings. Me as a musician or um, Alabaster as a company, we're creating, um, creating art so that it's enabling us to see with others' eyes. As soon as I saw the books, I, I knew I wanted to get in on the, the beginning of this project. I'm a photographer, and I'm maybe one of the perfect tools to uh, help me to have the conversation. What is that? What's this magazine? And you can be like, well, that's not a magazine. That's the Bible, and let's talk about Jesus. <laughs> when we're little kids, we get picture books or picture Bibles, and that's the way we're like first looking at the Bible. And so I just went online and ordered Romans, and. It's really given me just like a, a little extra shine, a little extra zeal in my everyday read. When I picked up like the Alabaster Bible, the way each text and scripture is kind of laid out remind me to slow down. It's also somehow given me this extra permission to insert my creativity in my day-to-day -day job. When I'm struggling or when I need inspiration, I would just look for a psalm that spoke to me and just pray on it. It served as a conversation started with my roommate, for example, who's currently exploring her faith and we hadn't actually talked about faith before. And she commented like, with all these heart emoji, just like, what is that? It looks beautiful. I'm interested. And I took out my whole collection. I was just surprised that there is such a thing as art and scripture coming together. It was so impactful for me because it, it just showed me that as a creative, that God's created me to be creative. And and I can use that no matter what I'm doing for him. So I actually find it so helpful to have something that looks like a coffee table book to offer to someone and say like, here, come look at this. I just wanted to say a big thank you to you guys. Thank you, Alabaster. 100%, I know all of it is, uh, you know, God is orchestrating something really beautiful. So glad that there's people like you guys to, to share the faith in, in such a creative and a beautiful way. What you're doing is actually making a difference and it's helping people see the word in a really beautiful and new way.